Hey everybody, I'm Gabby and this is RVs with Gabby. If you are into camping and traveling, if you love RV life too, RVs with Gabby is the right channel for you. How to buy and how to use, that's what I'm here to do. RVs with Gabby at gmail.com RVs with Gabby Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you love my content, please don't forget to hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that notification bell so you never miss another walk around video. All right, I am sitting in the back office today. Really quickly, I wanted to go back to those videos I was doing for newbies and um, people, first time buyers that were just looking for more information on features and benefits of certain products and the things that certain companies offer when you're looking to purchase your first RV. So the biggest one that I always talk about that I wanted to cover in today's um, episode, which by the way, I'm thinking of calling it Feature and Benefit Friday and maybe releasing one of those every week or every other week. Let me know down in the comments if you like that idea, if it works for you. Right now I'm just releasing my floor plan walkarounds like once every Thursday morning they come out. So I'm thinking about adding another one of these in, more informational, more educational uh, for those people that are really still in the research and exp exploration phase of their of their RV buying process. So today I wanted to go over one of the features that I always talk about anytime I'm going through any Jayco towable, and that is their Magnum Trust Roof System. Now this is a great system. It's gonna be a huge benefit to you as a customer. Basically in layman's terms, what it is, is your roof is gonna be more than double the industry standard of weight capacity for that roof. So most roofs in the industry, they're walkable, but they're rated for about 2000 pounds before they start to have any deflection if something heavier was to hit that roof or fall or be sitting on that roof. For the Jayco's, they're gonna have this Magnum Trust roof system, which is patented for them. And it is rated for 4,500 pounds before there's any sort of deflection. And we have this display in the main area of our sales floor um, at Orlando RV, which is really great for customers. And normally when I'm working a deal on a Jayco, I'll walk them over to this display to show them the pictures of the roof and the materials, because it's really nice to have this visual. So I just wanted to take a second on here and show you that and kind of walk you through the um, upgrades of that Magnum Trust roof and what makes it so residential, what makes it so strong, why is it so different from any other brand. When you're looking at a Jayco, you know, some of that price point of why it's not the entry level in terms of pricing of a travel trailer is going to be um, some of the features and standards they have on their units. And this one is a huge one, the Magnum Trust roof system. So let's dive right in. All right, so the first thing is going to be the screwed construction instead of the stapled construction. They use 3 8 roof decking at each seam and they screw it down. It creates a more firm, secure structure and reduces the chance of the fasteners coming loose and puncturing the rubber roof material on top of it. The competition is going to use staples, uh, which are not as strong and they're not as reliable as the screws. Pretty easy, right? The next one is going to be the oversized nail plates. Now these are interesting because it's you, it's hard to describe this to someone without showing them this visual, but they use oversized nail plate joint fasteners on both sides of the trusses, which makes for a much tighter truss with a lot less chance of, of movement. The competition, as you can see on the right, uses smaller nail plates, and in most areas, they only use them on one side of the truss, which actually increases the likelihood of that roof flexing a bit and giving you issues and leaks in the future. The next one is going to be the two by two vertical wood studs. This is huge. I mean, just looking at that picture alone, before you even see that nail plate, that aluminum piece, I mean, how much can it really do at one inch? Um, that two by two vertical stud is strategically placed to maximize that load capacity. The nail plates are also used on both sides of that vertical stud to just further enhance that strength. Everything Jayco does with this roof is with the intention of it being a benefit to the customer, to the consumer. It just creates a stronger roof. The last thing is going to be safer wiring and those two by two vertical studs, they provide a smoother edge for the wiring to sit on when they're running the, the wiring for the AC and the electrical through that roof system. It greatly reduces the risk of electrical shorts, but that one inch aluminum piece next to it, I mean, it's got sharp edges. They're, most, they're more likely to have electrical shortages when they have that wire rubbing against that aluminum piece for the entire, entire time you own your, your travel trailer. 
and I don't know why I said the wiring was last because there is one more and this is probably the biggest one. It's going to be a seven inch header beam while the competition uses two by six lumber. So between the roof and the slide out openings, they use seven inch header beams. They're more acceptable material that's used in home construction for those load bearing beams. The competition is going to use a two by six piece of lumber that just creates a weaker five and a half inch beam. So that all together, those are the components that really make this Magnum Trust roof system that I'm always talking about. I wanted to dive in deeper on it so you could actually see it, uh, get a visual on it, and this way every time I mention it in future videos on a Jayco, I don't have to go through that and I can reference this video and tell you, hey, go check this out, here's a little more information on it. I do want to show you that um, 4,500 pounds on a Jayco roof. You can see all those cinder blocks there, uh, super sturdy. There's no deflection until you hit 4,500 pounds is when they started to see some sort of deflection on that roof. And on the right, I love that they just write, you get the picture, 4,500 pounds on another roof. It's going to go straight through that roof. Uh, it's a lot less sturdy. It's a lot. It's not as strong. It's just a weaker roof system. So in the end, you're going to want a travel trailer that is not only the floor plan works for you and the interior is pretty, right, and it has enough storage, but you want something that's structurally sound. And I think that Magnum Trust roof system is a huge feature that you cannot miss. And the benefit to you is endless. Um, I had a salesperson in Albany that used to say he used to take his tailgating. He owned a Jayco um, 26BH. I think it was like a 2018. He would go tailgating and he and his buddies would stand up on the roof and party. Now, I do not recommend that by any means, but that's the idea was he could tell his customers and he could give them a visual picture of eight adult men standing on this roof system and it was sturdy. It was solid. It was fine. That is the Magnum Shows roof system, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. Let me know down below if this was helpful, if you enjoyed it, if you'd like to see more of these videos on a regular basis. I would love some feedback. Just comment down below if I started putting out a feature and benefit Friday video, if you would be interested in that sort of content. All right. Thank you so much. And until next time, happy camping.